Okay, everyone out there, thank you so much for watching the videos. Hope you're having a great day. Right now it is Monday. Do you hate Mondays? Here's a little, thank God it's Friday. Boy, do I hate Monday. Um, I don't know, I mean, since I do like acting and kind of gig stuff, it doesn't really matter what day of the week it is. You know, it's not like I'm going to school Monday through Friday or something or working a nine to five or Monday through Friday. Uh, I might work, you know, 15 hours on a Saturday and <laughs> no hours on Monday and Tuesday, who knows? But anyway, I hope everybody's doing great. Doing great, doing great, doing great. Are you doing great? Don't forget, please subscribe, like, and share. Uh, I'm making an animation there after all. I had to figure out how to place it. I uh, had a manager who did all that kind of stuff, but they all also did some kind of stealing. Um, every manager I had, I think, did something wrong. One minute was really great, but he just kind of just dropped off the face of the earth uh, and didn't complete the job that I hired him to do, which is to be the manager for I paid him monthly, um, and I think he worked 21 days out of the month, so he only stole 10 days, maybe 9 days, I don't know. Depends on how many days were in the month, but he only did that. He was from Pakistan, uh, two from Nigeria, both of those stole before they even got started, and a couple others from Pakistan, two from Bangladesh, yeah. No one from the U.S. There, no offense to other countries. It's just that U.S. is very expensive. If you want a, someone here that uh, speaks English like you do, uh, I'm not saying they don't, they don't speak English, but if they're local to you, let's say, um, like right now, if I was filming this, um, I think it's 13 hours ahead in Pakistan from me. So it's not a, it's not just three hours like Eastern time versus where I am Pacific time or mountain time, which maybe an hour ahead, or central time, two hours, whatever. It's a lot, it's like the next day, it's already you know deep into the next day right now, and it's only five o'clock here, p.m. Pacific time on Monday. So I'll have this video come out tomorrow at 1.30. I'll take it home. I'm shooting this here, this is not my house, this is behind me, it's at Tea Burger, I have iced tea. But anyway, the reason I'm making this video, is we sent number two if you go back that way you'll see a video all about it we sent number two through the mail to treasure boy and he said yay i got number two thank you for the number two you sent me thank you for sending me number two but he has it now i got there fast mailed it on saturday afternoon he got it today which is monday pretty amazing all the way across the country pretty cool huh um united states united states postal service is what i used i used the priority mail uh, box. It was, it was in a priority mail box. All I did is I took it to the post office with the address on there and typed all the information in on the machine. Then I tried to put it through the this thing, but they don't have one of those big metal ones <laughs> like they have at some of the post office. They only have the small one. So I had to go around and drop it off. So if I had to come there, I, I don't think you can go into the post office anymore when it's closed. You smell, uh, at least out here, a lot of the lobbies are open 24 hours a day. And you sell a machine, you can buy stamps, you pull a thing out, a little, two stamps come out, and that kind of stuff. Postal, postal rates are going up in July, by the way, here in the U.S., so be ready for that. Maybe you buy some more forever stamps. I don't know. Maybe I'll do that. That's, that's a good idea. Maybe I'll go buy a couple of rolls of forever stamps before it goes up. Uh, it is going to go up. I think it's like 76 cents or something like that. I don't know. She was telling me about that when I dropped that off. Uh, but anyway, the reason I'm going to make this a video is a couple things. One, I'm filming tonight at 7 p.m., so i got to kind of get out of here. Uh, it's just over here in Arcadia, California, so I'm right here on the border. Um, I can leave here as late as 6.30 and be there before 7, but I always like to try to be in about an hour early, so I'll probably leave here about 6. I mean, I'll probably leave here about quarter to 6 to get there at 6. That way, if they need me for anything early, you know, anything else, um, they can do that. They're wardrobing me, so I'm wearing a shirt right here. This is a scratchy cat. That's our cat. Sadly, he did pass away. Great cat. Great, great cat. Don't forget, there's some great cats at the shelter. What do they call them now? I can't call them the shelter, the not anything said uh, animal care centers. ACC, I think, animal care center. They have a different name. Everything changes. Everything changes. It used to be a guy was a guy, a gal, you can't really say gal, guys and gals. Uh, now it, it, that, that musical guys and gals, or guys, gals, they's, fluffies, non-binary, non-disclosed, whatever they call that, non we don't know that I know what you are, uh, don't know what I am, uh, transsexual, whatever you are. So it'll be guys, dolls, maybe 4,000 things. The marquee would have to be 
um, two miles long if you used a font about that big of all the things we are now. But this video is going to be out tomorrow. I think I'll do it at 1.30 p.m. Pacific time Tuesday. So I'll go and get it ready tonight and get it out. And it's all about Treasure Boy at Treasure Boy here. That's all it is. Or you can even put youtube.com slash at Treasure Boy here. That's all one. So it's Treasure Boy here. Don't, don't say Treasure Space boys but no 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 treasure boy here treasure boy here like a run on sentence that's a run on word i guess treasure boy here at simple mine is at david lost 108 pounds so there's no space in those so you're on david lost 108 pounds please subscribe if you haven't done so already uh we may have another challenge here i'm going to tell you about his uh i have a contest going on on my channel he has a contest on his i think his ends at the end of this month mine ends on the 14th of june and then we may start another one. I do also have the, we also have the treasure hunt going on. Remember that treasure little capsule is hidden. I'm probably gonna have to put it in a larger box because the capsule is a little bit too small. Maybe you can win that. That's, that's hidden in the Arroyo Seco between South Pasadena and Pasadena right there. And it goes into LA, but we're not in the LA section. It's at the border of Pasadena and South Pasadena right there. Uh, further, what way is that? Further south, I guess, is Los Angeles or I don't know, but we're in the South Passing Passing area. But what I'm going to tell you right now is he's going to do an unboxing of what he got. Now, I don't know what's in there. I don't know. He doesn't know. The guy who put in there probably doesn't remember because I think I've had those boxes for a year and a half, maybe a year. He'll probably open up. There'll be something dated, expires, you know, a year ago. If there's an expiration, I don't think there is. But um, hopefully no broken frame or a broken mirror or a broken looking glass because he had a broken frame last time he did have a couple of pairs of glasses i forgot what they had cup players and sunglasses um some stockings that not stockings like you would give to a fur line for fur line right is their name uh uh on hocus heroes <laughs> not like that but a stocking that you hang up in santa claus would put some treats in that stocking um and i did have a few kind of cool things some cheap looking jewelry but um the guy who gave this to me long ago, he doesn't care if he says it's cheap because he just takes a bunch of stuff and throws a box until he gets a certain number. I think he says he tries to, I don't know what he said. Did he say he tries to put 10 items in each medium box? But if they're big items, I don't know. I Can you still put, I mean, if I've got a big box and I put 10, you know, little matchbox cars and I put eight matchbox cars and a, and a dice set, a set of dice and a, and a whistle, or something equal ten. It's gonna be that. It's only gonna take up that much room in that box. But he put ten larger items. I don't know how he does it. How do they do on those mystery boxes? Is it by weight? Is it by you know? If you lay up a bunch of boxes and you're gonna prepare some mystery boxes, I wonder how you know what to put in there. <clears throat> now on my channel, um, back that way, you're gonna see that I have a video of me unboxing a large mystery box. And if you go to that channel, you can save fifteen percent. He, the guy who owns that company, he's also doing a, a, a challenges. Challenges everywhere. He has 10 boxes that he's doing, and one of the 10, I think, has $100 in it. Not $100 worth of stuff, an actual $100, like $100 bill or a check for $100. I don't know how he did it. Um, that's pretty cool. So you go back there and watch that. One says, I'm unboxing a large box, and the other one says, there's an update. So right after the long video of 45 minutes of me doing this unboxing, there's another one there. But this video right here, he's Treasure Boy's gonna unbox that and film it. And hopefully his wife won't say it's all junk. And they, they neither one of them bought it, so I guess I don't have to argue about who messed up by getting that box. It was a freebie that's coming to them. Hopefully she'll like it and keep something because she likes to keep it if it's good and call it junk if it's bad. So let's see what she says. Is she Ms. Treasure Boy? Is she Ms. Is she Treasure Girl? Does she have a title to Treasure Boy and Treasure Girl, like Raggedy Ann and Raggedy Andy? I don't know. But they're going to get that, and he's going to try to shoot that and have it published on Wednesday. So you'll be seeing this tomorrow. Wednesday will be the next day. Now, if it's not there, things do come up. You know, sometimes we have to our, our real job. Don't quit your day job. Uh, so the May came up, come up, like today. My thing that came up is I was supposed to film at 5, and now it's 7. So, um... That's a little change, two hour change, but it could be, we're not gonna film on Monday, we're gonna film on Thursday. So I might have had things scheduled on Thursday and have it moved, so that does happen. So don't get mad if it's not ready, but go to on Wednesday or today even, and 
sign up, subscribe, you know, subscribe to his channel so you will be notified when the new videos come out. I'm subscribed, so whenever something new comes out, I know. So on Wednesday, he should have that out. But if he doesn't, maybe it's going to be Thursday. Maybe it'll be Saturday. Who knows? I know they were trying to get a storage unit. And I don't think they had any. The well, last I heard, he didn't have any luck getting another storage unit. I think he tries to get like one a week. That's a lot. I mean, I don't think he buys a huge, huge, huge ones where they're like, you know, $6,000. And they're, you know, a, 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 you know, 10 by 20. I think he's getting more like 5 by 10. And that size is maybe 5 by 15. I don't really know. 10 by 15. But there's some really, really huge ones. Some of them are like as big as a, you know, a, an old-fashioned Kmart or something, you know, uh, or maybe not that big, maybe as big as a 7-Eleven. But they have some big, big um, square foot, square um, feet of uh, a, a space. So he tries to do one a week, I guess. But anyway, at Treasure Boy here, at Treasure Boy here, at Treasure Boy here. I'm even going to type that and put it in the comment section and in the uh, description. So go over there. Subscribe to his channel. Subscribe to my channel too. Like and share on both of our channels. We like we like you to like, and we like you to share, and we like you to subscribe. So if you can do that on both of our channels, we'll be both very very happy. Uh, and you can watch him unbox that box. It's a medium sized box. So, uh, you know the long one. The one he got last time was like the long one, and this one is kind of squared. If you want to see what that box looks like, go back that way, and you'll see a video of him holding his nose. It's not really him, but a guy holding his nose because he got number two. He selected box number two. We, as a channel, selected box number two. Now let's see if number two equals number one, as in the best one ever. Have a great afternoon, night, day. Maybe it's already Wednesday. I mean, Tuesday, where you are. It couldn't still be Sunday. So maybe it's Tuesday already. I don't know. Hopefully you like this video, and you'll subscribe, and you'll like, and you'll share, and you will like his unboxing. Pretty funny. If you watch his videos, his wife is really, really funny. She should be a comedian. Maybe she is. I don't know. Maybe that's her night job or her day job, or I don't know. I know she has a job because he talks about helping his wife's boss do something. And so I know she has a job. And I think she wanted, she said she's not feeling well and she wanted to go home, but they, on their way home from work, they stopped and looked at a, a, a locker that they bought. And hopefully, old Treasure Boy did all the heavy lifting because she was not feeling well. And that's the way it is. It doesn't matter if you're a woman or a man, whoever's not feeling well should be the one that sits in the car with their head on a pillow going, okay, yeah, that's very, very nice. A toilet brush, yes. What? Oh, oh, what? Oh, old sticker stuck to a notebook. Yay. That kind of thing. We want to be that person. The, not the... You don't want to be that person. Or the, cleaning up the... You know, you know how it is. Take care, everyone. Feel well. Feel well. Uh, the channel, I will have a new video of, based on the more fitness stuff. I do have a, some... I, I have a, tomorrow, I do have a another Taste Test Tuesday. And that goes with our fitness program. Uh, our program is not really fitness. Our program is not really exercise or diet or weight loss or removing inches from our bellies or looking good in our, our bikinis. It's all about a healthy journey. I hope you're having a healthy journey too. Take care, everyone. Bye.